Hello everybody, welcome back. Welcome back to my Valentine's Day theme week. We're gonna put a Valentine's Day theme recipe every single day this week from a Monday to Friday. So today we are making some marble chocolate bark. I don't even know how to title this. I had such a hard time trying to decide what to call it. But basically these are chocolate hearts and they have a marble pattern on them which I think is super pretty. But I also wanted to do something extra. So I've turned them into chocolate bark. So basically chocolate mixed with like a bunch of different ingredients. You can choose like literally whatever you like. I just like raided my pantry and found like stuff that might taste good in the chocolate. Um, but for the pink we have some freeze dried pomegranate seeds, some chocolate biscuits, and some and some hazelnuts. I always forget the hazelnuts. And then for the dark chocolate we have some teddy grams, some pretzels, and some soft caramels. So I think these are so delicious. But you can definitely use anything that you like. And if you're looking for something really, really simple for Valentine's Day and you just have like a silicone mold kicking around your house, this is so easy to do and I definitely recommend it. So let's get started. So first you want to fill a heart-shaped silicone mold with the bark ingredients. And I actually got the silicone mold as a gift from Wilton, so thank you so much, Wilton. Your stuff is amazing. I oh, love Wilton. Um, and they sent this to me because I'm actually doing a video with Wilton. So uh, head over on over to Wilton's Instagram account. They aren't telling me to say this in this video, but I just remembered. And so sorry for like chopping the recipe in half. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'll have all the information linked in the bio in the description box below. So check it out and let's continue on. Then pour the pink candy melts or some dark chocolate on top and tap your counter to ensure a flat surface. Then dollop some extra candy melts on top and swirl with a little lollipop stick. Then try to the bark to the fridge for the chocolate to set for about one hour. Then just unmold and you are done! So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you liked this recipe. This is also actually perfect if you have children and you're like, you need to bring something to school and you want something that you can make in a large batch, just get a couple of these molds and you can bang it out in like an hour. It's so easy. Um, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you're notified when tomorrow's Valentine's Day video goes live. It's not uploaded every single day this week. And yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.